Mm. Botswana should have a hundred year plan. That's that's what I think. We should have a hundred year plan instead of a short term two decade plan. Get a chance to to share this vision at Forbes and how was it received? It was by entrepreneurs, other entrepreneurs. It was received very well. Mm. I mean, the Forbes event when we we're talking about education, because I believe education is the bedrock of of everything. Uh, I actually got my biggest partnership from Forbes mm-hmm. for Grey End. Mm-hmm. She deployed across hundreds of schools in the developing world. Mm-hmm. And that's because that that company aligns with our vision of democratizing quality education. Mm-hmm. So someone born in Moshupo who can't afford private school uh, school fees, that's okay. Mm-hmm. You can still access the same quality education. That's the dream. That's mm-hmm. the vision we have. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, it was received pretty well. I mean, young visionaries at Forbes. Are so. you at, at liberty to share that uh, partnership? Uh, no, not yet. Uh, you signed NDAs and things. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we talk about transforming education and healthcare in the emerging economy. How do you actually go about doing that? You do that by changing the mindset. Mm-hmm. Right now, everyone is operating on a finite mindset and on a scarcity mindset. Mm. Meaning that finite is short-term thinking mm. and you have a certain objective, I want to be rich. Uh, your business has that object, I want to be set metric. That's the finite mindset instead of, no, I'm in the game to stay, I'm in here to stay as long as possible. That's, that's what businesses are supposed to be doing. Mm. Mm. And then abundance and scarcity is scarcity is this not enough of everything so i'm going to keep it off myself and mm-hmm. share. yeah you know that's the that's literally what we operate here mm-hmm. abundance is there's so much of everything yeah let's collaborate and let's share mm-hmm. you know so that's we we need to change that mindset mm-hmm. because when you go into it when i go talk to people it's the short-term goals that's that's the thing and i'm like no no, no but we, we're in here for 10 years we're in here for 20 years yeah let's let's aim there that's what we should be talking about mm-hmm. but Sana should have a hundred year plan that's that's what I think we should have a hundred year plan instead of a short term two decade plan. Mm.